So last time was an absolute disaster. I'm going into this final part with optimism. I think this is going to be a really strong finish. I think I'm really going to enjoy what's in store in these next five levels. I think it's going to be great. And nothing, nothing is going to go wrong and nothing is going to ruin this experience. Okay? We're going to end this on a high. Whether we need to get high to do so, I don't know. We'll see what happens. See, look. Crash and Burn, probably the best level in the game. Like it's fun. This is gonna be this is gonna be really good. I'm I'm gonna enjoy this. I can just tell. Look, to be honest, I'll take anything over what happened during that mech level. That was just an absolute disaster. And then the submarine level afterwards. It's just good to finally be playing a good level. And the, like the reason this level is so good, like oh, it, it's you know it's designed well, it's fun to just go through. But like just visually, like the setting, the way it's laid out, the vibe, it's just really cool. And I think this was the first level they actually made for this game, right? So it makes sense. This one got the most attention. Like, we're ascending this active, erupting volcano? That's fucking cool. It's way cooler than swinging around slowly on monkey bars in a glitched out spaceship. See, I think for the first time in this whole... This whole playthrough, I don't have anything to complain about in this level. I've got nothing negative to say. See? We even got all the crates. This is a good level. It's too bad the rest of them are shit. Now this level, Gold Rush, I remember liking it when I played it as a kid. But I've heard that a lot of people don't like this level, so I'm looking forward to finding out why. I'd like the Wild West theme, even though it's not really, you know... You don't really think of it as being a sort of Crash Bandicoot theme, but it's kind of cool. What I think would be really cool if they did, um, I think it was like a concept at some point, but if they did like a, a sort of game where the theme was like different movie genres and different TV genres. So you'd go through like old timey Wild West movies, you'd have um, sci-fi, You'd have fantasy, you'd go through all these different themes. I think that'd be super cool. And like, there's so much room for creative ideas there. They could do literally anything they wanted. See, this level's fine. I don't see what the big deal is. It's perfectly fine. Oh. Maybe I spoke too soon. <laughs> oh no. Like, did they play test these monkey bar things? Did anyone find this fun during development? Because no one's finding the monkey bars fun here. Still, not enough to ruin the level. I think this level's fine. I've still got no complaints. Oh, okay. That wasn't the level's fault, that was my fault. I just mistimed my jump, or not mistimed, I misspaced my jump, but that's fine. You know, we can always go back and have another go. Optimism. That's the theme. I'm being optimistic. <gasps> okay, I was not expecting that. That was close, that was close, that was close, that was close, that was close. Jesus Christ. Okay, that could have gone really badly. I definitely would have been angry about that. Oh, look at that. See, that was fine. What pe What's people's problem with this level? Like, sure, the monkey bars are kind of shit. 
that little um, my it wasn't a mine cart. What do you call those things? Where you you, you push them and they go along the tracks. I don't know what you call that, but whatever that was, you know, it it wasn't great, but it wasn't terrible. It was fine. I think people just need to stop whining and complaining about every little thing, and just accept that not everything is to your liking. I think this level is fine. I quite like it. God, it's gone on a while though, isn't it? It's a long level. More monkey bars. Hmm. Okay. No, I'm still, I'm still optimi I'm still positive about this. I. This is a good level. I like this level. <gasps> Didn't mean to do that. It's got 209 crates. This level is huge. Is that why people don't like it? Because it's long? At least it's not fucking underwater. You know? Take the good with the bad. And just push through. Although pushing through is a lot harder when it takes a thousand years. I will say that. There we are. See, what was wrong with that? This level's fine. I really enjoyed that. We've got two big hitters, two good levels back to back. Crash and Burn and Gold Rush. We're off to a good start. I feel like it's going to get progressively worse. Because we've got three levels left, and I don't think they're going to top either of those two levels. So I'm a bit concerned, but we'll see. Oh, Medieval Madness! That's another good one! See, this level's good too. Medieval Madness? Are you kidding me? It's like wizards and lizards in the atmosphere. It's so good. It really sucks that they put the good levels at the end of the game. That's kind of shitty. Because you have to get through all the other crap to get to the good stuff. But you know, it's worth it in the end. I think it's worth it. This is fun. I'm having a good time. Because last time was miserable. You know, the fucking glitched out mech suit. Okay, that wasn't great. But yeah, the glitched out mech suit. The, the submarine. Fucking, the end of Weathering Heights got to me for some reason, even though it's the easiest part in the whole game. Like, things just weren't going very well. But I've recovered, um, and I'm feeling good. I'm happy now. You know, pain is only temporary. Happiness is forever. That's probably some bullshit Shakespeare quote or something, right? If not, I'm going to trademark that and make some bank off of that. I died to that nitro crate again. Maybe I should do something differently. <laughs> that didn't happen the first time. Alright, I'm not going to die to that nitro crate again. We're in serious, hardcore Crash Bandicoot gamer mode. Okay. Hang on. Hang on! Oh. Look, it's not the level's fault, it's my fault for being bad, okay? I'm just rushing and not taking my time, not properly assessing the situation, I'm just going into it, because I'm excited to play a good level. Can you blame me? Right, slow and steady. Let's take it easy, take it easy. Huh? Okay, this is st starting to bother me a little bit. Um... Still, I'm still positive, positive vibes, positive vibes. That's how we're going to get through this. I reckon I should approach that nitro section differently. Because, you know, the definition of medieval madness is doing the same medieval thing over and over, but expecting something to go medieval differently. Okay. 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 There we go. See? All we needed was that positive energy. G'day Tiny, how are you? You having a good day? I'm having a great day. That sounded sarcastic. I'm 
genuinely having a good time with this, because this is a good level. Oh, maybe I should not go this way. Can we go down there? Is that worth doing? Ooh. Oh no. I feel like that was a mistake. That was probably a mistake. Was that Velo on the wall? No, it's just some ugly gargoyle. Easily confused. It also kind of reminded me of your mum. The question is, did we get all the crates? We got 99 lives. We're missing five. How are we missing five? Oh well, doesn't matter. Still a fun level, even though it wasn't as successful as I would have liked it to be. It was pretty fun, and I'm still having a good time. Oh. Crate balls of fire. I feel like my positivity is going to be challenged with this. Yeah, yeah, okay. I can see exactly how this is going to go. Monkey bars. Bloody hell. Oh, it's not freaking out. We've actually got... We can actually see. I'm... You have no idea how pleased I am that I can actually see what's going on. Because the last time we used this fucking machine... Jesus Christ. And that's, that's adding to my positivity. I expected this to go wrong. But, you know, here we are, having a good time. Because we can see what's happening. I don't care how shitty the vehicle is. I don't care about the fucking exploding spaceship behind us. We're having a good time. Miss some crates? Who cares? I don't know why we needed the mech suit for this. I'm sure Crash could have just run. He's quite good at that. He does that a lot. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. No, we were just... Things were just going well. Things were fine. What the fuck? Oh, not again. Please, not again. No, please let this be some sort of twisted joke. I can't see. Oh, there's a platform. Oh, oh God. I thought we were off the hook. I thought everything was going to be fine. Okay, got rid of him. Fuck. Oh, dear. Oh, no. <laughs> No, positivity, we've done this before, we can do it again. We've done this before, we can do it again. Oh, that's the end. Is that the end? Please tell me that's the end. No more. That's the end. That's the end! Oh my god. Oh. Thank Christ. <sighs> At least that wasn't as bad. That definitely could have been a lot worse. Crash, you've been a naughty boy. But now that's going to end. Man, some of the dialogue in this game is shit. Oh, that's not true. All of it's shit. Okay, so we had a bit of a setback with Crate Balls of Fire, but I'm optimistic that this final level is still going to be somewhat fun. Hey, it's nice and colourful. 
uh, which is good. Um, I can see what's happening. That's also good. That's sort of where my positivity positivity runs out for this level, but we'll see. What's happening to my screen? Why is it starting to fr- Oh. I swear, please don't freak out again. Please. Just, just, just stay as you are. I love you the way you are. You don't need to change. Just make sure I can see what the hell's going on. That's all I want the game to do. Alright, you ready for this? This is going to be the most epic part of the game. Whoa! Isn't this cool? And that's it. Bug Light wishes it was that cool. Oh, I can't... What is happening? Whatever. Whatever. We even got the gem. Okay, let's just... Okay. It's fine, because the first three levels... It doesn't matter that that level was shit. It doesn't matter that that level was shit. It doesn't matter that Crate Balls of Fire was kind of shit. Because the first three levels we played were great. And that's all that counts. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay. Aiming the bazooka? That's going to be the biggest challenge here. Okay, I think there's one more. Oh, you, you're joking. I was going to do it first try. God damn it. Okay, just one more round and then we're done. Get him. Fuck, are you serious? Ah. Oh. Are you joking? I was so close. Come on. Right, if I fuck it up this time, I'm going to be furious. No, no, no. Positivity. Positivity. We're going to win. This is going to be good. Victory is as good as mine. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, come on, come on. Hell yeah. We did it! So this game, although it had its hiccups, it had its aggravating moments, it made me upset a few times, I will admit that. But overall, I think it's a pretty okay game. You know, I wouldn't recommend it, to anyone, because um, I think most people, their lives would be ruined by this. But um, overall, I enjoyed it, I had fun most of the time, and that's what matters. So I guess that wraps up this playthrough. Um, I suppose I should do what every YouTuber does, and um, beg the viewers to like and subscribe to the channel. Um, so yeah, go ahead and do that. Um, if you watch this playthrough from start to finish, um, thank you. Cheers, you're a legend. Um, it could not have been easy watching me suffer, so I thank you for that. And um, hopefully, I'll see you in nicer circumstances, because this, this has been rough.